But we were we kind of scrapped those. We went back to the drawing board, and um, these are completely new power supplies. Completely EVGA design. There's a lot of new features, especially on the 1500 watt mm -hmm. power supply that are that you don't find, you won't find on the market today. So, for example, let me just say first first of all, firstly, we're not dis disclosing too many details about the power okay, supply today. Understood. But I can tell you that there's a software package that goes along. Okay. With the power supply, and uh, for consumer power supplies, it's the only one you'll find in the market. You see, um, there's a connection so you can connect to mm -hmm. the internal okay. USB header. Um, the cable design, we're not showing the cable design today, but I can tell you that the cable design is is different than anything you've seen. Um, we wanted to really try to be innovative on, on our power supplies, even down to the PCB level. The PCB is six layer PCB. Mm -hmm. and traditionally, you'll find four layer okay. on most high-end power supplies. Um, it also has a feature called OC mode. Okay. And um, it's not really overclocking. I mean, mm -hmm. it doesn't have clocks really, but we call it that because it's an easy way to understand. Essentially, you can run the power supply at 1650 okay. by flipping a switch. And when you flip the switch, provided you have, you need to have 220, right? Okay. Provided you flip the switch, and you have 220, you can run up to 1650 watts, and you also get 133 amps on the 12 volt rail. Holy crap! Wow. Um, <clears throat> the fan speed runs a little bit higher to make sure that you know everything can run stable cool. at the higher wattage, mm -hmm. but you can do it. Um, one of the other new features about the power supply is that you can customize the 12 volt, right? Okay. Not just like single or multi. I mean, like you can select. How many 12 volt rails you want to use? Nice. And um, yeah, so there's a lot of new stuff with our power supplies. We're really excited about it. it. There's also so if you look on the back here, there's some switches right there, and those switches allow you to manipulate the power supply. Mm -hmm. A lot of the features we're not discussing today, but you know you'll be able to do things like OC mode and that kind of stuff. Okay. And uh, you can also make it run in what we call dummy mode, which means um, that when power is connected to it, it just runs. Okay. So that's useful for people who run multi-power supplies. Right? Mm -hmm. You don't have to like jump or and all that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Just plug it in and it'll run. So we're going to have top to bottom. 1500 watt will be our highest. We also have 1000 watt. We have 750. We'll also have 650. And uh, so these are all gold rated. We'll also have bronze. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. Are these uh, developed within uh, EV engineering? I, uh, the last uh, EJ was based on the Quattro Pro, was it? The Anti Quattro. The Antec one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, these are these are EJ designs. Yeah. The original. They're yeah. Not they're not taking an existing. Yeah. Design. Complete, yeah. Totally unique. Yeah. They're completely unique. So.